Montreal. <laughs> we have a couple of special events coming up in the next couple weeks. This next Sunday, Contra Costa is having their gay pride celebration at Heather Barnes Park. It's our big gay picnic at Heather Barnes in the Asia Valley Road. Woo! It's only 10 bucks. It's all you can eat barbecue. This year there will be beer and wine. Lots of entertainment, lots of picnic games, and most of all, lots of pride. The event's from 1 to 5 o'clock in Heather Farms, and we'd love to have all of you guys come down. With that, with your paid admission, you get a fancy little wristband. Come on back to 12.20 at 6 o'clock for our second annual peak party, and with that wristband, you get one free cocktail. We have a lot of fun, music, dancing, drink specials, as well as a special drag show that night featuring our girls. Plus, the amazing Miss Kitty Litter. So, we party. We would love to have you guys here. And the following weekend is a very special event for us here at 1220. It's our 6th annual charity drag show. Uh, last year's show raised $3,531 for the San Francisco AIDS Walk. All of that money comes back to Contra Costa to keep our free HIV testing clinic 100% free and open to everyone that walks through our doors. So please come out on Father's Day, Sunday, uh, June 19th. The event starts at 6 o'clock with raffles and fun and drink specials with a very special drag show featuring all of our girls, Miss Kitty Litter, and my dear friend and co-worker, Miss Honey Mahogany, will be here as well. So come on. You guys saw Honey Mahogany last year at the Pink Party and ate her up. So we're having her back. So please come out. Today marks the 30th anniversary of the AIDS epidemic. Uh, 30 years ago today, the CDC really recognized that HIV was a real threat. It started with five guys down in LA, and at that point, two of them had already passed away. After that, it spread out to every major city across the country. Every gay ghetto was hit. And San Francisco, East Bay area was definitely hit with that as well. This morning, a bunch of us from 1220 went down to the Cow Palace to see all of our boys from 1220 take off for the AIDS life cycle. Yeah. Uh, we're so proud of them. This year, the AIDS life cycle broke every record. They had over 2,000 riders, and they raised $13 million. Yeah. Carl Schultz or Bob Massey on Facebook. You can follow their progress. They've already reached their first destination. They rode over 90 miles today on their bikes and they're, they're relaxing in Santa Cruz. And in five days, they will land in Los Angeles at the Gay and Lesbian Center. So please keep with your thoughts and your prayers. This is a really amazing event and they're doing it for you guys and for those that we've lost. So keep that in mind. We want to see you guys come back next weekend for the Picnic and Pink Party. The following weekend for the charity drag show, we want to beat our, go our raise money from last year. And if I can reach $5,000, which I'm almost halfway there, I will be doing the walk in those red six-inch pups you saw earlier. So please. No, not red pink. It's the AIDS walk. you got to wear the red ones. And with that, we're going to close out our show. DJ, uh, DJ Mike, we take the battle music. All right, so we're going to get together. For our bartender, Mr. Rick Newby-Lajerine. Robert the Door Whore. The amazing CJ Mikey keeping the music going. Woo! And with that, let's bring out the cast of tonight's show. Please put your hands together for jealousy. Also, let's bring out the amazing, who just 
Saki's the Marlin Dream! 